Kate Sanalee's Creations. I hope you all are having a wonderful day. Um, I just got done doing a Periscope today. It is Saturday the 23rd of January. And Periscope is actually like a live feed thing that you can do um, from your uh, iPad or your cell phone. And I... Um, uh, was asked some questions. Um, I did, I'll show you what I did for the Periscope. I did, I posted a, um, for the Creative Arts Collaboration on YouTube, um, the hashtag color of the year art, okay? I had done this little ATC and the bird. So I went ahead and painted the bird for those of you that follow me on Periscope. And I was asked how I drew my bird. So I'm gonna show you real quick. I'm just gonna do it on my drop paper. Um, usually I use watercolor paper to draw my little birdies on um, because it's a sturdier paper. It's better to use for that. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and, and draw it out, and then I'm going to post this up for all, any of you that follow me on Periscope and wanted to know how I drew my bird. And just imagine like you're starting a fish. Okay. See that? Yeah, there we go. Okay. So you're going to it's going to look like you're starting a fish. All right. And then you're going to come curve up that for her, the tail feathers all right just like that and they can be you know lower or higher or whatever okay and then I go ahead and I put in an eye and this is also a way to make a fancy fish if you wanted to all you'd have to do is put the you know but I'm I'm making a bird okay so then I'm going to put in the beak right about here Okay, and you could put it down lower or high, you know, depending on how you, what you're in the mood to do. I just do mine like that. And then I'm going to make the legs. Okay. Okay. And I'll zoom in to show you the feet because it's a little harder to see the feet, okay, when I do them. Might be a little too close. Come on, focus, focus. There we go, it's focused, okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the feet. So I just do like little claws, almost like little fingers. And then a little, most birds have that claw on the back. It helps them maintain their balance when they're standing on a tree trunk and they have something to grab onto to hold onto the tree. Okay, and now I'm gonna zoom out and I do the little stripes and I do kind of a curved line to give the illusion that its legs are round, you know, have some, some uh, like a 3D effect almost, you know, dimensional, give it dimension. Okay, and then I just color it in with a pen. Usually I use a pen where I'll start out, I'll sketch this out with using a pencil and then I'll go back over it with using a Faber-Castell a pit pen in a thin nib. Okay, and there's the eye. And then I'm going to do the the uh, feather. Whoops. I'm going to do the side feather. Okay, so I'm going to come in and I'm just going to do a curve first. And I come in and just do little curves like that. Almost like you're doing a backwards E. Okay. And there you have it. And then you know, if you were just drawing something like this and you wanted to just color it in and you're not using paint or whatever, you could add little lines like this for the feathers and I kind of go in and add some lines in here. You know, you could you, you can do pretty much anything with this. Okay, now if I wanted to make a fish, if you're interested in knowing how I make the, a fish, I just use pretty much the same shape. Okay. But instead of doing these curly cues, I might make see that. 
almost like you're drawing a leaf. And then I'll just go in and do something like that. And then here's the face, here's an eye for my fishy. He's a happy fishy, okay? Or he's a full fishy, he's got, okay? And then you could do, you know, scales. Um, you could add another fin there and another fin here. You know, you could do a wavy fin, kind of like that. So that's how I do my fishies, okay? So kind of like the same way you would do this guy. So I hope that helped, and I hope that you will, um, if you liked this little short little doodle, um, you can throw me a like, subscribe, share, and comment, and I shall see you next time. Thanks for watching. Toodles. Bye.